The Pro Football Writers of America released its all-rookie team on Tuesday. No Green Bay Packers made a list. With that as our starting point, and the usual caveat that plenty can, and perhaps will, change over the next three years, here's our hindsight is 2020 draft. For all the conversation of whether the Packers should have drafted T.J. Watt in the first round, perhaps the biggest blunder was what they did with the first pick of the fourth round. After bypassing outside linebacker in the first three rounds, my board was on the two potential instant impact players, Auburn's Carl Lawson and Wisconsin's Vince Beagle. At number 108 overall, the Packers selected Beagle, who did practically nothing as a rookie. Beagle, with 21 and a half career sacks at Wisconsin, had no sacks or quarterback hits as a rookie. The Packers had better hope that lack of production was because of a foot injury sustained during his senior year at Wisconsin and again at the post-draft rookie camp that sidelined him until midseason. Lawson, taken by Cincinnati at number 116 overall, led all NFL rookies in sacks and quarterback hits. After recording nine sacks during his final year at Auburn, he had eight and a half sacks and 21 quarterback hits as a rookie. Watt, by the way, had only 12 quarterback hits. The Packers got a taste of Lawson's brute power in Week 3 when he had two and a half sacks. The Packers missed out on one other rookie pass rusher in the fourth round. At number 131, New England grabbed Dietrich Wise, who had five sacks and finished second among all rookies with 19 quarterback hits.